born and raised in uh, Chup, Micronesia. I came here when I was seven, 16. So I came here not even speaking this at all. A lot of, yeah, police, yeah. Depressing being pulling, and I just like to get it. Maybe I need to learn martial art, learn, learn that, you know, art. It is, I was like 18. Two of us, uh, in four, was a little bit boxing. I, was, I didn't really follow to it. And then when back then it was just karate, taekwondo, and it was like, man, I want to learn that, you know? And then that's what it came into it, karate. I was doing a lot of uh, in a competition tournament at that time, karate tournaments, and all through those years. I think that's what it changed me, just of, you know, learning the, the art of, you know, karate. And then from that, from that day on, I was like, man, I think this is good. This is gonna be good for me. It's still hard learning. Like, uh, besides that, it's like the discipline of it. It's thinking, like, you know, it make me like, you know, when you the first day you get in, you get hurt, you get hurt, and you want to challenge that. I want to, I want to learn more because I want to get better more. And then, and then that's what really came me into it. Well, because all my life, like I said, I was taught as a, as a, as a striker, as a karate, and then, then learning Muay Thai for a few years. And then what I was always watching UFC, and I said, man, I want love to learn that. You know, want love to enter that cage one day. And then uh, what I discovered PJJ, and that's what it really changed me a lot. And that's what pushed me into becoming an MMA fighter. I think I was age, I was 39. That's what I was making my, uh, my uh, debut, amateur debut. And I know my wife doesn't really like it because it's, it's, a, it's a brutal sport. It's not just you doing that and punching here. You do everything. I could get hurt in there. And that's what, that's what one thing that gets my wife gonna fit her. Cause I have three kids. <laughs> she said, don't fight. <laughs> Why I fight? I guess it's both, I think. It's just to test myself. And, and then, uh, like I said, you know, I was back home back, you know, I was a kid, I always been pulling. I always get, come home and, you know, get hurt all the time. And that's what maybe kind of really, you know, kind of changed me, kind of look back in my young age. And it does make me feel like, you know, because I already know all that heart. And then I want to like test myself out the same to see what I what I can do. This is what the knowledge that I learn. I learn from here, from learn different technique. Maybe I can do it. Because I remember before when I trained at few few uh, few teams, and they were telling me that because of my age, I was passing that thirties, and they look at me. I don't think if you're able to. That's it. And I said, don't be estimate. <laughs> you know, I think I can still do it. You know. And that's why I always just keep training hard for it. Uh, I have uh, three fights, two pro and one, uh, one amateur. I decided to stop fighting because when I have a new newborn baby, that's what it, it changed me. Yeah, it's like 12 years different. So that's why it changed me not to fight anymore because of the baby. Yes, come on. This is the guy right here that changed my life. Yeah, yeah, look, 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 yeah, yeah, look, 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 you say yeah. hi? Yeah. No, you don't want to say hi? <laughs> you say oh, okay. hi, you say hi. Uh, what does it mean to be a, a, a father? Uh, you know, what, what, what kind of father are you? Uh, I don't know what to say. I mean, you can look at me, I could put this smile on my face. 